Good morning, everybody, and happy Easter. I know that some of you colored eggs for today's Easter message, but even if you didn't, if you have an Easter basket with colored eggs inside, I want you to get that right now. And while you're doing that, let me remind you to join Mr. Jeremy and me later today at 5 o'clock on YouTube for Easter Jam 2020. We're going to have some fun and look at the Easter story in a whole new way. All right, do you have your eggs? All right, here we go. A tisket, a tasket. I have an Easter basket. It's filled with lots of colored eggs, all there for you and me. A tisket, a tasket. It's such a pretty basket. I wonder what the colors mean. Let's look inside and see. All right, look in your eggs and see if you have a green egg. If you have a green egg, I want you to hold it in your hand just like that. The green egg reminds me of the green palm branches that the children waved when Jesus rode into Jerusalem on Palm Sunday. He came riding on a donkey, which meant that he was coming as king. Jesus is the king of kings. Now let's see if we can find a purple egg. Let me see. Oh, there's one right there. If you have a purple egg, I want you to hold it in your hand. The purple egg reminds me of the purple wine that Jesus shared with his disciples during the Last Supper, the Seder meal that we talked about last week. During that meal, Jesus surprised the disciples by bending down and washing their dirty feet. Jesus wanted to teach the disciples to serve others just as he was serving them. Now let's look for a red egg. If you don't have a red egg, pink egg will do as well. The red egg reminds me of Jesus' big red loving heart. Jesus loves us so much that he died on the cross so that we can be forever friends with him. Now that's a lot of love. Now I'm looking for a yucky brown egg. You might not have one of those, but if you do, hold it in your hand. And if you don't, well, you can take a look at mine. The yucky brown egg reminds me that after Jesus died, some of Jesus' friends put his body in a dark cave and rolled a big, heavy stone in front of it so that it was closed. That day made Jesus' friends so very sad. Can you show everybody your very saddest face? Now let's look for a white egg. Do you have a white egg in your basket? If you do, hold it in your hand. The white egg reminds me of an angel. On that first Easter morning, an angel told Jesus' friends that Jesus' body was no longer in that dark, lonely cave because Jesus was alive, and that made Jesus' friends very happy. So now let everybody see your happiest face. We have one more egg to go. Let's see if you can find a yellow egg. If you have it, hold it in your hand. The yellow egg reminds me of the bright yellow sun that rose in the sky on that first Easter morning. A bright new day had come. Now Jesus can be with us every day. What a happy day. A tisket, a tasket. I love this Easter basket. It's filled with colorful eggs that help me tell the Easter story. A tisket, a tasket, there's good news in this basket. Jesus rose on Easter morn, a gift for you and me. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for this Easter day. Thank you that Jesus is alive and living with us now and forever. Help us share that good news with those around us. In Jesus' name, amen. Happy Easter!